Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. A month ago, I posted a video that Google Circle to Search could be coming to Microsoft Edge. And Circle to Search, as the name implies, is a new way to search anything on your phone with a simple circle gesture. You know, you circle around a product or an item and you do a search accordingly. Now, I'll leave that video down below if you would be interested. But as I mentioned previously in that video, uh, Microsoft is wanting to adopt the same sort of feature. And in Edge Canary, which is a preview version, they have renamed the Circle to Search, Circle to Copilot. So now currently in the latest preview version, version 123, uh, the Circle to Copilot has been moved from the mouse gestures um, to the actual appearance page where it has its own section now on the appearance page and there's been a couple of developments since I last posted so just a quick catch up if you would be interested now first of all if we just head to the appearance page in the settings and we just scroll down through a long list of customization options here we can see that we have mouse gesture this is where it used to be previously um, in the mouse gesture configuration settings. We have super drag and drop, which is another feature Microsoft's working on, as I've posted previously. And now Circle to Copilot has um, its own section and menu set up now on the appearance page. So obviously they working on this a little bit more now and have made some improvements. And when I posted previously, uh, this, this Circle to Copilot had to be enabled using a command line flag, which is no longer the case. So it's basically become a default feature on a controlled rollout in Edge Canary. So this seems to be a feature that could be making its way to the stable version eventually in an up and coming update. Now, if we head into configure circle to copilot, for some strange reason, maybe I'm missing something, but I cannot get this circle to copilot to work. But there is a shortcut to launch circle to copilot, which basically uses a rectangle instead of a instead of a circle to perform the search and it basically gives you a square or a rectangle a rectangle on your screen where you can search anywhere on your screen so i'm going to demonstrate using the shortcut because i can't actually get the circle to search to work still early days maybe i'm missing it but i'm sure you'll get the general idea so using alt shift and x which is the shortcut so that's alt shift and x now you can see now I can basically highlight a section on a web page or in the browser and it draws a rectangle square around that section and then here we see it says chat with copilot and then I can click on that and as I mentioned in a video I posted yesterday which will also be down below this will open up Windows 11's copilot not Microsoft Edge's copilot in the side panel and that's because they are further integrating um, AR between Edge and um, Windows 11. And I'll leave that video down below. And here you can see, there's the little section I highlighted. And I can ask Copilot anything about that image or that section of web page or whatever I've highlighted. And it'll give me the relevant answer or the response. So just wanted to bring that to your attention if you are following new features uh, in uh, the Edge browser and the Canary browsers. Still early days, as mentioned, I can't get the actual circle uh, to Copilot to actually work, but I can get this um, shortcut to launch circle to Copilot, Alt Shift and X to work. And just wanted to demonstrate that if you would be interested. And if I do see any more enhancements on this feature, as in, you know, a little bit more work is done or I see that it's heading towards stable, obviously I'll keep you guys in the loop. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.